Hi there, my name's Aaron Hayden and I'm a video producer here at Firefly Studios. And today I'm very happy to be presenting a development diary update on our online co-op city builder, Roman's Age of Caesar. Firefly is perhaps best known for our castle simulation series, Stronghold, now playable on both PC and mobile. But we also have a very deep history with Roman city building, with designers, composers, artists and producers from the Caesar days still working at Firefly Studios today. We have long awaited to use this expertise in Roman city building and historical knowledge in general and put it to good use in a new Roman themed game. While there's plenty to do in Roman's Age of Caesar, from rebuilding each and every Roman city with 15 other players, holding back barbarian invasions or doing your usual trading and exporting as you'd see in other city builders, today we're gonna to be talking about the upper echelons of the game, the Senate. The Senate is the beating heart of the Roman Empire and the place where you'll be doing your political endgame fighting in Roman's Age of Caesar, eventually claiming the title of Caesar himself until they are eventually and inevitably stabbed in the back as well. Using Senate points to keep your seat in the Senate will give you essential production boosts, increase your storage caps and give you other key bonuses in both your economy and armies. But just remember, the Senate is not kind to those who cannot pay their way, and any degradation in your political capital will see you dragged down to the antechamber, where you'll have to start your whole political ascendance anew. If you're fortunate enough to reach it, the inner chamber of the Senate is the powerhouse of the Roman Empire and holds the greatest rewards for those within it. The cost to seat oneself within the inner chamber rises on a daily basis. A senator at the apex of the inner chamber within the Senate can shape the game world of Roman's Age of Caesar for months to come. History is often written by the victors, and the victors are chosen within the walls of the Senate. The Senate game is one of the most complex and exciting features of Roman's Age of Caesar, and we cannot wait for our online players to experience it at full at launch. Roman's Age of Caesar will be available next year on iOS and Android devices, but it's currently in open alpha. So if you want to play an early version of the game, provide us with some feedback and help us craft Roman's Age of Caesar into the best game it can possibly be, you can head over to playromans.com.